ties. Rising in popularity recently as high school males and even some females attempt a classier appearance. This spike can be attributed to one of two different sources. The most popular and uncontroversial being that some young celebrity singers have started to use ties in their music videos and kids are emulating this. Love is in the, air tonight. the other more abstract idea is that teen guys are trying to imitate the look of popular video game monster Slenderman. Businesses requiring ties as workplace attire is nothing new, but the hip joints that are down with it, such as Cheddar's Restaurant and McGee Music Productions, are starting to use more vibrant, colorful ties. What is most perplexing about this trend is that most men choose clothes that are functional rather than fashionable. So then why are so many of us wearing ties? To answer this question, we have gone to the lab with our lead clothing analyst, Jasmine. What can you tell us about the connection between high school males and ties, Jasmine? As you said, the average male chooses his wardrobe based on its functionality. And while a tie gives a sharper, classier look, it also has a list of practical applications. These applications include use as a measurement tool, a nice dining napkin, keeping your hands warm as a glove, a sweat or headband, and fixing broken stuff. A tie can even come into play when fighting the forces of evil. It works as your signature mask, a way to restrain hooligans, a defensive tool, a convenient way to chloroform those suckers, and even makeshift handcuffs. Bow ties are also part of this tie trend, but while they might make you look like Matt Smith's 11th Doctor Who, they just simply cannot perform the same tasks a traditional tie can. And some might consider them part of the same family, but bolo ties and ascots are not going to be popular anytime soon.